it's 4.30 and I'm up. It's 6.30 and I have my three points. I'm improving yesterday. I had my three points at nine. I have training. Training in one hour. Look at the bay. You can't look at the bay because it's full of rain. I'm going to meet a girl that also lives in a boat. He met her yesterday and we are going to go for a training for a regatta. So outside is raining. I don't think I'm gonna be filming a lot. <laughs> Bye. This place is amazing. It is like a village. So yesterday I was going to get the shower. And here, like in front of the shower, there's a place where you can sit and eat something and speak with the people. Then I met a girl here yesterday that lives on her boat here in the marina. And she, we just met in front of the shower. Bonjour. And she was like, well, you know, tomorrow there will be training and we are getting ready for a regatta. She invited me at this regatta, so now I'm going to meet her here. We are getting there and we're already full in water. Check this out. This is sea water and we are in the mangroves. I made it. Uh, the girls are already on the boat. The boat ready and then start sailing. See ya. We just came back from the training. I really loved it. It's uh, midday. It was uh, an amazing uh, day. We had uh, really good wind and the girls are amazing. So I hope I'm going to be back with them for the training uh, next Saturday and then at the competition on Sunday. Mwah! We have this cord and I'm gonna put it back just because I took it away from my and I see that they have it. The next clip uh, deserves a little bit of an explanation. So after the training, when we uh, came back, uh, we uh, did a little, little bit of briefing and we were sitting on a circle down and we were all yeah, concentrated to hear what the skipper has to say and what we have to improve and how everything went in the sea. So everyone was concentrated and then you know, I'm new, so they took a little bit more time to explain to me where I'm getting ready for a competition. And yeah, I was just very happy to be there. But when I'm like in this situation, I'm just really concentrated and I try to do my best because this is a new world to me and all. So a girl from the team, she just took out her phone in the middle of the briefing and she said, oh, I've been looking at you all day and I think that you're the girl that flies on the street. And then she puts a video with me and she was all smart and she was so happy it's just amazing to see how people they light up they they hear the music and they light up and they say oh i've been standing there for hours and she was like this and i don't know if the skipper really liked it or not <laughs> but um i think she would have preferred just to keep it to the briefing but that was such a nice moment somehow how people just suddenly they lit up and they smile with this huge smile and I said oh the music and so what's the next clip I didn't I didn't I didn't put the video okay like the, the girl took out her phone and she shared with the whole team the my playing on the street super sleepy still have training and editing maybe i will just get used with it and stay tuned so i can't beat myself up and i was up at tea and it was quite windy so it's okay to be a little bit tired but yeah i'm getting ready for my run
说，嗨。came back from my run and now I have editing and then it's family time it is such a nice view over the bay that up there is the moon I'm so happy so this movie I really liked, The Martian. It's about a guy that gets stranded on Mars. He gets left there by his crew and he has to survive on this planet. There's no one there and he has to be so inventive and I really liked the movie. I went to the movie with the expectations of it being a little bit like Interstellar, which it wasn't the case. It was a different kind of movie, but still very beautiful. And I got the book. And I think it's so funny when you put the book like this, like in this lighting, I find that I kind of look like this Martian guy that got left on Mars. <laughs>